meters away from my stopped car. Daylight, and no doubt it was a large black cat. Bigger than a large retriever and very muscular tail as long as its body. Say 5 feet so just under 10 feet with tail. Scary moment. Only reason I do this not to prove but to share my experience and possibly validate others who have also seen large black cats in the wild. Many people have reported sightings of big black cats in various parts of the world, including the United Kingdom, Australia, and North America. These animals are often referred to as panthers, or black leopards, but they are actually melanistic forms of jaguars or cougars. Melanism is a genetic variation that makes the skin, fur, or feathers of an animal appear darker than usual. The existence of black panthers is a controversial topic because there is no conclusive scientific evidence that supports their presence in some regions. However, many people claim to have seen them, and there are numerous photos and videos that show large black cats in the wild. If you ever come across a big black cat in the wild, it is best to stay calm, keep a safe distance, and avoid making any sudden movements or loud noises. These animals are usually shy and elusive, but they can be dangerous if they feel threatened or cornered. Overall, the sighting of a big black cat can be a thrilling and unforgettable experience, but it is important to respect these animals and their natural habitat. It was a quiet day on the road as I drove down to Sutton Courtney gravel pits. The sun was shining, and the trees cast shadows down onto the winding path ahead. As I turned the corner, my eyes caught sight of a big black cat perched on a rock basking in the sun, its silky fur glinting in the light. Startled at first, I slowed my car down to a halt, and watched in awe as the cat stood up, stretched lazily, and padded away into the undergrowth. I was left wondering had I just seen a wild panther or was it just a large domestic cat gone feral. As I ventured further into the gravel pits, my thoughts returned to the mysterious creature I had seen, wondering if there was any more to this story. I looked around, and saw that the area was deserted, except for a few water birds paddling in the stream. Suddenly, my attention was drawn back to the black cat, who had re-emerged from the undergrowth, and was now crossing the stream under the shade of a nearby tree. I watched as it continued its journey way into the forest, mesmerized by its grace and beauty. Driving back home that day, the image of the big black cat stayed with me, leaving me in awe of the natural world and the power and magnificence contained within it. Even now, years later, I still think about the mysterious creature I saw, and wonder 